Hi, I'm Deborah Cornick. I'm the editor of the RYA magazine. We've come here today to watch the autumn issue cover printed. There's an awful lot of effort that goes into um, the RYA magazine. As soon as we've finished one issue, it's time to start the next issue and start planning what's going to go in. Uh, it's quite a difficult job trying to please so many different disciplines across the RYA. You've got windsurfing, power boating, motor boating, sail, but I'd like to think that we try and get the balance right. It's not easy trying to please all the people all the time, but we try. It's the good thing about my job is I get to talk to more or less everybody in the RYA, um, training, cruising, power boating, um, about what's, what's new and what's, what up-to-date news we should be telling members. A lot of friends that are, that are members of the RYA or people I talk to at boat shows often say, you know, we have three members in our household um, so we get three magazines when we only really need one. Um, but please tell us, you know, tell us if you only require one magazine in your household just give us a call or send us an email. The RYA cares about the environment and obviously if we can send you one copy that's best for you and best for the environment. It's always a nice moment seeing the um, RYA magazine printed and finished um, but it's certainly a nervous feeling as well. Um, hoping that all that t hard work and time has paid off and that members will enjoy it but it's certainly a nervous time. Obviously there's many ways that we can communicate with members, um, such as the website and e-newsletters now, but I think that the RYA magazine is still an important way, and members tell us it's an important way for us to keep them up to date on what's happening and what the RYA is doing for them.